Hi there, Mouseketeers. Kate, Princess Minnie here. And if you are a returning friend of my channel, then welcome back. I'm so excited to share some at least to my knowledge, fairly new Loungefly Disney pins that I bought at Hot Topic. Um, I'm really excited to share this with you guys. I just bought them the other day and like I am known to like sit on things, but I was like, nope, I want to get these filmed like right away. And also guys, if you've been following along with me in October, I've been opening up these Nightmare Before Christmas uh, pint size heroes, but I did not finish. I had so many to open and it just didn't happen. But you know what I figured? November is a great month to continue that as we're leading up to Christmas. We're getting out of the Halloween season, Halloween, Christmas. We're in the middle ground, right? So this will be perfect to continue. There's still a lot of bags left. So we're gonna open up six of these single pins. There's only one pin per box. Um, lounge fly Disney pins. And then we're gonna open up three of the Nightmare Before Christmas pint size heroes. And if you are new, then make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you get notified uh, when I post new content. Also, don't forget that notification bell icon for that same purpose. And also, anybody who maybe likes these pins, let me know with a thumbs up like with this video. And please make sure to comment down below. I love connecting with you guys in the comments, so please, say hello at the very least. I would love to say hi back. Okay, let's get started. We're gonna start with the pins. We're gonna end with the Pint Size Heroes. And so, like I said, I went to my Hot Topic. I really wasn't planning on buying pins, but these were like just freshly put out. That's why I think they're new. Um, there are nine options. And this kind of follows like that Hot Topic concept of let's take a character and put them into object form. Like I know I've opened these before and Woody was a sheriff star or Ursula was, well, I'm still not sure what Ursula was. It was kind of like a, maybe a cauldron? With tentacles? I don't know, it was very bizarre. <laughs> I liked it, but it was bizarre. Snow White was an apple, things like that. So he, let me show you what the options are and I'll tell you which ones I'm kind of looking to get, but honestly, I think every single one of these is a slam dunk. I would really be happy to see any of these. I would love to see six unique pins. I definitely kind of riffled around in the display box a little bit, but honestly, I like all these characters. I think they're all such neat representations. The top four that I do want, I, I wore my Toy Story ears today for uh, good luck, but I would like to get Buzz as a spaceship and the alien from Toy Story also as like a maybe i'll call that like a rocket ship it's a little more it's a little different design and then i definitely 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 want mushu um as a fan or maybe it's supposed to be mulan because her comb is there but mushu's on the fan either way from the mulan movie and then jack skellington as a pumpkin is pretty sick so i'm gonna go with those four marie as a ball of yarn i love i don't really collect marie but i still think it's just super cool they're all great. And then I'm wearing my, my Stitch shirt, also um, Hot Topic. And the, so the scrump bow I think is super cute, but I would be thrilled to get all of these. I would have bought maybe nine boxes because they were buy two, get one free, I'll tell you as I was opening this. But I grabbed, but the girl like behind the counter told me they were buy two, get one free. So I went over and started grabbing and I grabbed six. And she go, she literally goes, oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, maybe I'll just stop at six, <laughs> okay? So I cannot tell which one this is, but it does feel like pretty sizable, which is nice because these are a little pricey. Oh my God, this is perfect. It is Buzz's uh, spaceship. Yeah, we'll say spaceship for Buzz. I think this is so cute. I love Buzz's colors. They really just like speak to me. And I'm feeling Toy Story right now, of course. So I am so thrilled to get this. The quality is super nice and this is, kind of like one of my new favorite pins. All right, grabbing our next box. So now I'd love to get the alien spaceship, rocket ship, whatever, to go with Buzz. I think that would be perfect. Okay, let's see. I'm just gonna, without preamble, just go right into this one. 
Okay, this one is super nice. It's not one of the ones that I mentioned I would like the most, but that's completely okay. I think this is gorgeous. It is the queen of hearts, and she's a literal heart, but she's in, you know, the classic black, red, white, and gold, which is a great color scheme. And we're big poker players in my household. We love playing poker, specifically Texas Hold'em. And um, it definitely just makes me think of playing cards as well, so... I'm all good with this. I love this. It will definitely be staying in my collection and could be fun on like a villainy themed pin board. Love it. It's also good for Valentine's Day, I guess, right? Kinda? A little? Sorta? Maybe. <laughs> One thing I really like about this set is that I was instantly able to recognize every single character despite the fact that they're missing most of their details except for colors right um so that's pretty pretty awesome that they could do that again the fan which oh i really hope is in here the fan that has mushu on it also has mulan's comb so you could argue whether that's really representing mulan or it's representing mushu mushu's a little since he's directly on there that might be a little too on the nose but either way it, it's recognizably from that movie all right all right this one feels like it might be a little smaller Oh my gosh! Guys, I want such a roll! Because I did really like the Queen of Hearts when I liked all these. Uh, but it's the fan! And it's teeny, 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 tiny. Oh, the quality is a little bit off on this one, unfortunately. Um, and it's little. So, honestly, I would really hope that one of these other boxes does contain a double of this teeny, tiny little pin. Well, it was a buy two, get one free deal, so I'll say that that flawed pin was my free one. That makes it feel a little bit better. Okay, we have three left, then we do our Nightmare Before Christmas, so hopefully this will be Jack. This one feels large. Could be Buzz again, but not sure. These bags are really thick, so it's hard to get like real good details. Oh no, my gosh, it's another new one, and it's beautiful. It is flounder from the little mermaid of course and it has that little pink flower that i feel is like really recognizable from that movie but like in this moment i couldn't tell you where in the movie it actually is <laughs> like, i don't know like i know it's from little mermaid but i i don't re recall the the specific scene or anything but i've always loved flounder so this is a really good one i don't know if it'll stay in my collection long term but i'm really happy to have it now is left we're definitely hoping for I mean I need that's not a double except the Mushu fan I, I might have to go back and get more of these or I have a really substantial trader board right now uh, let me flash it to you really quickly I'm not really ready to trade unless it's like for one of these specific pins that I'm missing but I will put up a video probably honestly in 2020 like in January or something because now we're on the lead up to Christmas and there's no way I can make a whole bunch of trades before then because I will just be all over the place but let me just quickly flash you my trader board Ugh, oh god this is a board full of my traders it's intense and these are just like doubles double traders these are not even like me going through my collection and being like display this pin or use this pin I should probably get rid of it so I really should have more than this and I just gave away a whole bunch of pins I'm ready to like start trading but it's a process so anyway if you happen to have one of the ones that I uh, need after this unboxing please feel free to contact me and I would be happy to share my trader board more in depth because I would really like all of these pins and not have to go out and purchase more boxes okay this one also feels big I'm thinking it could also be the rocket ship. <laughs> no, wow, I'm so bad at this. Again, these bags are really thick. This is amazing and it's so large. It is the scrump bow. So it is again, a new pin. Like it is, we haven't hit any doubles. This is really good luck, honestly. And I can live with the Mushu pin flaw if I have to. So I'm pretty pleased with this luck. last box for this video and last box that I have purchased up until this point. So the ones we're missing are the Cheshire Cat teapot, 
beautiful. Uh, the Marie Bulve yarn, amazing. The Alien Rocket Chip, definitely one. But I also have a very bad track record of opening up pins that have the Alien as an option. I like never get him. And then Jack is a pumpkin. So one of those would be perfect. Let's see, let's see. I shouldn't even try to guess because I've been horrendous at that. <laughs> Oh, finally the luck bit us. It is another scrump bow. So I'm just going to put that on the board and not show it close up. But one thing I will say that I uh, noticed after I did the last close up is that this is the only pin, at least that we opened today, that has like this um, gunmetal color um, backer and Hot Topic does these little butterfly clasps instead of um, Mickey backs because obviously, you know, they're not, they're not Disney. They're just licensing it. And... The others all had uh, gold borders and gold butterfly clasps. And now my trainer board is just a little bit more full. Okay, let's open up the three Nightmare Before Christmas Pint Size Heroes. So bummed we didn't open up that Jack Skellington pumpkin, but I'll get my hands on him. And uh, I will show all those pins at the end as well. So let me show you the options. And I'm only missing a couple of these. And the rest are going to be gifted, or I actually have a craft in mind that I really want to do with uh, some of these. So doubles are always good, especially because sometimes you get them and they might have a mark or a blemish and you're like, darn it, I really wanted it to look perfect. So sometimes then you get the perfect one. Win-win. We're gonna open up three of these today. I only need four to complete the collection. I need Scary Teddy, Lock, Shock, and Behemoth. So let's hope three of those are in here. The first one is Lock! Oh my gosh, perfect! Okay, so Halloween is over, but we have a trick-or-treater. Don't have any candy to give him, so looks like I'm the one getting tricked. <laughs> Since I already have Locke and Barrel, I'd love to see Shock the Witch in this one. She's my favorite of um, those three characters. Oh no, but it's another one we need! It is Scary Teddy. So he's one of the toys that terrorizes the children on Christmas morning. Doesn't that just put you in like all, with all the Christmas vibes, guys? <laughs> He's kind of making me think of like a demented Mickey Mouse here. Shock or behemoth? Shock or behemoth? That's who we're rooting for. Then I will only be missing one from the set. And I'll be opening more of these, remember, throughout November. Oh, okay. Well, not so bad. I do have two of him already, but it's Jack Skellington. So he's classic. You can't really go wrong with Jack. And he's an easy one to give to people as well. super happy with the pins we pulled today you know only one double out of six boxes is really good luck i think and then the, the pin i kind of wanted most the mushu pin because um my husband and i both love the Mulan, the movie mulan and we both love mushu i am a little bit bummed there's a flaw on that but it's still a really really cool pin so definitely remember let me know if you have any of the other pins and you really wanted that scrub bow or if you'd like to see the rest of my traders So let me know, friends, are we pin twins on any of these? Have you ever seen this set before? Are you going to rush out and buy it? Um, and which of the options from this box intrigued you the most or would fit best into your pin collection? I'm going to have many, many more Disney-themed videos coming up soon, friends. So I hope that you are subscribed and that you are going to stick around. I'm already ready to, getting ready for Vlogmas. This background is not going to last very much longer. I cannot wait and I cannot wait to see you again real soon.